Hello guys. So, I'm a little disappointed in my server mates right now. One of the things that we had whenever we first started the server was a whole rule of expectations. We want this to be a different server than normal. This is a Christian server. This is a place where you can go to have fun, to hang out, to do a lot of stuff. And so we wanted to set up things different. But one of the things that I do love about a lot of different servers on there is the idea of pranks. In fact, our rules actually suggest pranks are encouraged. Now, these can't be pranks where you go and grief people. You can't go and steal things. You can't destroy things. But pranks are very encouraged. And right now, pranks have not been done. And I'm a little sad by this so sad that I feel like I need to just go ahead and start people off. So with that being said, today we are going to have the first prank on the server. And let me just put this in context for you guys. Our server started in March. It's now well into the summer. And so this is, what, many, many months and not a single prank has been done. It really is quite sad. I'm not sure how I've been able to survive this long. So we're going to go do a little bit of stuff. And if you can't tell by my inventory what we might be doing, I've been doing a little bit of resource gathering, just a little bit. I've got the automated farm going on here. I've got the automated pumpkin farm over there. And what happens when you mix iron and pumpkins together? What do you get? For all you Minecraft nerds, you are correct. You get golems. So, I figure... Our server has a lot of people on here, a lot of mobs potentially can spawn, and I need to protect all of our participants. And what better way to do that than to provide a security system with golems. So I'm going to go to all of the active people on here. There's a lot of people on here, but there's several active people on here. And you're required to make a spawn base before you do anything more. And so, I figure I should just go ahead and take care of everybody's spawn places. Now this is uh, Wes, um, Wesley's, and I'm not quite sure how I'm going to do this. Let's see. Got to get a little automation going here. So we got that. <laughs> so we could put it right there. No, can't. All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to fill up some of these places, and I will jump right back. All right, I didn't expect this to take so long, but these little boogers get in the way every single time you try to install them. So, we have a whole congregation, and for some reason, they're, I think they're Baptists, because they're all sticking to one side. But, you guys have fun. Enjoy your service. Just so you guys know, I'm not going too crazy on this, because I want to make sure I don't do the griefing thing. Oh. That makes for a headache, just trying to get in that door. Um, because I don't want to cause lag spikes. Um, one of the things with my slaughterhouse is I have a whole bunch of cows in there. I have the sugar canes going at random times. It sometimes causes lag spikes. So I don't want to do that to everybody that's on the server. Especially, we don't know what kind of uh, internet they're running. So um, when you run the OBS software as well as the everything else that's going on, it can sometimes cause a little bit of lag. And I'm only doing this for the people that have been active in the last month-ish. Um, so some of the people that are on the server but haven't been on in the last month, I'm not going to do just because I don't know if they'll be able to see this or not. Oh. I, don't, I thought this was a house. I guess not. Um, I know where most everybody is are, so if I don't know where you're at and I don't do your prank, then maybe we need to try to figure that out. So we'll see. Um, we're coming up on a new member. He did a little fun thing that we're gonna. This might be a spoiler. Who knows? Or might never come out. Um, he does a lot of live streaming, so look for him whenever you're trying to do some kind of live streaming stuff. Um, but we're gonna fill his place up too. So I'll get this full, and I'll see you guys in a minute. All right, to get this next one done, I had to do it down in his basement because his upstairs was a little bit small. That's pretty cool. He's got a little lava ceilings. So I had to kind of limit his just because some of them were suffocating and now they're getting too full. So on to the next house. 
Alright, we got another base coming up on. Wow. Let's make it a little deck house here. wonder what that's going to be for. A lot of redstone. I like it. Alright, how do we get in? Change this up a little bit. If I'm correct, I believe this is Josh's house. Though, oh my goodness. No, don't break it. Please don't break it. Please don't break it. <gasps> Broke it. Oh no. Oh good, that's all it broke. How lucky was that? Alright, so this is Josh's house, I believe. The problem is, Josh, you don't have any doors. How am I gonna... Hmm. Hmm. Oh, jeez. I don't want you sneaking up on me. Alright, I'm gonna fill this place up before I destroy any more of it. I'll jump back. Alright, this one is done. I don't know if they'll ever be able to get go down to these places. Josh, you might have a lot of different places to look for your little guardians here. Ooh, even has a little lava pit. Oh, cobblestone generator. Nice. Um, so, I will also say I understand the awkwardness of needing these guys at the iron farm to kill them and get the iron, then to Therefore, build them. I get the irony in that, so. We'll see. So I got a couple more people over here I gotta get to. And, wow. Creeper damage, I think. We'll have to get that repaired. I like these little pathways. These are actually Tim's design. Connecting everybody together. What is that? Oh. I think this is a Geeks. Or Sean's little setup here. He has a little place that goes to, out to his own place way out in the distance. Nice. So I am only sticking to the spawn places, which means that his is going to get very crowded here. So I'm going to set this up. I'll see you guys in a second. Alright, so we are done here. I think this is it. That's all I could fit in there. It's not as many as the others, but it's a little house, so got to make do. Tim's is the next one. He's way over here. I like that. He got a little channel. Um, so another thing about the pranking just so you guys know as far as the context of everything is if you prank someone then whatever resources are there goes to that person so all these resources all the iron that gets collected if they do decide to kill them will go to the person that I pranked so I can't just ask for these resources back so if I'm pranking them I don't get to keep the iron in the pumpkins so I think that that's just something to keep in mind as well with all of this um, Tim, where does your house actually start? I think it's over here. So this is Tim's base. You've seen on a previous episode. Um, he actually has a whole place out away from spawn now that he's created, but I'm going to go ahead and print this place. And... Hmm. I'll be right back. Alright, we are done. We are actually ended up in... Mugabe's house. It's a very lovely house. Now it has a lovely protection system. One th last thing I'll note is that I did not want to go all out with this prank because I figure it's going to escalate quickly. We have a tendency of doing things over the top. And also with these kind of pranks, I have to do them quickly um, because otherwise I'm afraid that it's not going to work out fully. So everybody's up at the house now getting to enjoy the recording. So figure I'll just end it here, kind of show off the last little bits. Grant, can you say hi to me? Hi. <laughs> so I'm going to leave it here. I'd love to hear what you guys have to say. Got any prank ideas? Anything I can do better next time? We got a lot of golems we could be making, but again, didn't want to add to the lag. Didn't want to overdo it this first one. So we'll see how this goes. But give me your prank ideas. I'd love to hear what you guys have to say about these. So we will talk to you guys next time. Bye. Say bye. Bye.